today's video i'll be mainly focusing upon the types uh, you must have heard in various uh, for various diseases you must have heard that there are certain carriers for it so you must have heard that for so and so disease this person became the carrier and for this disease this person became the carrier so uh, when we talk of carrier so when we uh, look at any microorganism or for any disease what we find is that carrier is a person is that person who is harboring the pathogenic microorganisms and that person without any uh, without suffering from the effect of that micro microorganism so whenever um, you must be very well aware that for the causation of any disease there has to be certain microorganism and if any microorganism is there that has to be transmitted by some or the other ways so if that microorganism is being carried through some or the other uh, forms by some or the other vehicle so that vehicle is called as a carrier and the definition is saying when we talk of that carrier is a person who harbors the pathogenic microorganism and without suffering from the ill effect of it so that is the definition for carrier and in this video we'll be mainly focusing upon the types of carrier because in various competitive exams in multiple choice questions you are asked about uh, from a particular option that choose what type of carrier it is so the first it is the healthy carrier so healthy carrier is the one who harbors the pathogen but but has never suffered from the diseased caused by that pathogen so if it is a healthy carrier so that healthy carrier is never going to suffer from the disease caused by that microorganism and that person is just going to harbor the microorganism associated with the disease next it is the convalescent carrier so this convalescent carrier is the one who has recovered from the disease and continues to harbor the pathogen in his body so when we look at the uh, the definition for convalescent carrier it is telling that in such a condition the person has already suffered from the disease but now the person has recovered from the disease but even after recovering from the disease the person is still continuing to harbor that pathogen within himself all right all right next is the temporary carrier so temporary carrier the state lasts for less than 6 months so in uh, there are certain microorganisms who are responsible for causation of a certain disease but when it is uh, the person will be called as a temporary carrier only when that that microorganism is going to harbor that individual for a period less than 6 months so if somebody is harboring a particular microorganism and that to for a very short duration of time for lesser than 6 months the person will be called as a temporary carrier next when we call it is as the chronic carrier so this state is going to last for several years and sometimes even for the rest of one's life so it has been seen that there are certain individuals who became become the chronic carriers of a certain microorganism and that microorganism is going to sustain in their body for even the entire lifetime so such persons they are called as the chronic carriers and when we find uh, the next type it is the contact carrier so one who acquires the pathogen from a patient so if a particular from a particular patient certain microorganism is being uh transferred to another uh, individual so if it is through certain kind of a contact then that person becomes the contact carrier and last but not the least that is the paradoxical carrier and this carrier the definition of it is says that paradoxical carrier one who acquires the pathogen from another carrier all right so the pathogen will be to the other individual through another carrier so this was a very short discussion about the types of carriers and what are the different types of carriers and what is a carrier so in basically in pathology in medicine you are um, come, must be coming across this term carrier and these are the types of uh, carriers i have tried my level best to simplify 
for you. If you still have any queries or comments, you are most welcome to comment me in the comment section. And viewers and students who are new to my channel and who haven't subscribed yet, go do subscribe my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can be further updated for my upcoming videos. Thank you for watching.